All right, so this video is to answer a question from one of my YouTuber, uh, YouTube subscribers, Vtest. I hope I, I said that right, Vtest. All right, so the question was, how do you clean a Hover Phantom 2 Intilinet fabric? Now, I'm not an Under Armour uh, professional. You know, I don't understand. I'm not the developer or designer of the shoe. However, uh, I'm curious to know as well, and perhaps maybe other YouTubers or uh, people who want to know more about cleaning the shoe may be interested. Uh, let me be clear though, while you're here, this is not how to clean it. This is for me to know myself, knowledge of what Under Armour representatives have to uh, suggest for cleaning the shoe. And also what I use to clean my shoes that I know confidently work very well. Yes, so it's the Intilinet or sorry, Hover Phantom 2 Intilinet shoe. Specifically, the color would be white. Mm -hmm. How do we get that cleaned? Okay, for that one, it should be... Let me check if we have that information. You can check our website as well, how to um, clean or care those items. Let me check on my hand. Hold it. All right. Okay, still checking. I know it probably wouldn't be wise to put it in the dryer. I think for me, it's more of the surface because it's white, a white fabric uh, of the intilinet. And I don't know what intilinet is. Is it nylon? Is it polyester? Is it a combination of the two? And, you know, how do we best prevent it from yellowing? or putting more stain if we use a different soft or uh, soap. Hello? Oh. Yeah, I'm still here. Can you hear me? All right, so I'm not getting a solution here on their end. They're not providing me with anything at this point because the phone service is not working out. But as you can see, there's not really uh, a lot of people who would answer a call and give you an immediate answer. These are things that they too have to look into, which is a understandable situation. But I think this is a, a con for businesses to have uh, professionals not having an understanding of their products and how to best take care of them, right? Now I understand that's a specific department perhaps, but that's where I'm getting at too. It's like, hey, look, if you don't know, that's totally fine. Please pass me on to someone who may know to assist me. But I don't think they're able to do that either. Hello? Yes, hi, can you hear me? Hello, are you? Yes, I can hear you now. I do apologize for the bad connection. Okay, to clean under armor shoes, first remove the excess dirt and mod with a dry brush. And then we recommend using mild detergent and warm water to remove any set and stains with a sponge or cloth, hand wash only and let it air dry. Okay, and would you by chance know or recommend any particular detergent? Um, no, there's no specific detergent, just use a mild soap or mild detergent. Okay. And warm water as well. All right, and that's not going to... Sorry. I'm oh, sorry, go ahead. That's not going to stain the shoe, right? Yes. And if it does stain the shoe and it jacks it up, can we return the shoe because of following these instructions and it failed? Where did, where did you, when did you purchase it, item? It was over the 30 days or 60 days. It's like a little over two months now. I said, do you have any proof of purchase? In case there is, um, or the item will um, damage, or the, you can go ahead and email uahelpunderarmor.com. Okay. And just send a picture. But don't worry, once you use a mild soap or mild detergent and warm water, it will be good to your shoes. No, it, it happens. I totally get it. So I do appreciate that you're willing to at least look into how to clean the shoe and uh, getting back to me. So thank you. That's all. You're welcome. And thank you for calling Under Armour. You have a great day. All right. You too. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye for now. Okay. All right, 
So there you have it. That's how you clean the Hover Phantom 2 shoe. Are you satisfied? Probably not, because I know for sure I'm not. So what I'm going to do is share with you real quick how to you what kind of equipment would be best to use on especially white fabric. I wouldn't I wouldn't even play with bleach. Bleach has a tendency to turn things more of like a yellow stainish look. So let me grab my stuff real quick and show you. All right, so now here's what I use personally to clean my shoes and make them spotless white. Uh, and I don't have white shoes per se. It's more of like that white uh, foam area of the shoe. And this is where I got at the mall. So it's called Refreshed and uh, it's a shoe cleaner. It's also available on Amazon. I'll put that link in the description. Uh, but essentially this is what I have. I paid about 40, maybe $50. Uh, for a kit a small kit to clean my shoes and it works very well if you use this brush now Say you don't want to go that route. You know what I'm saying if you want to go to Walmart or a store Here's what I would suggest. I don't know if you can see that. Let's get that. Come on Panasonic work with me. Sorry <laughs> All right, so these guys here have these little crystals or items like very very tiny little scratchers scrubbers if anything and they work phenomenal on fabric there is one con the more you rub the more some of this starts to break and uh fall off but it's not like permanent you know what i'm saying you can always remove it and dust it off it's like an eraser for actual fabric i think that's what it's called right yeah an eraser so you rub 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 it's going to start to deteriorate but it will clean very well and once you're done cleaning you just dust off the extra uh loose items or particles that come off of this fabric works very well on cleaning shoes but before you use this as the rep said I would use some soapy water and something like this a mild detergent which is good on, on whites as well you put it in the water foam it up right and if you get this guarantee it's gonna make it very clean you put this on it as well you scrub with this first to get the bulk of the items off and then of course use uh, this to get rid of the rest and making it spotless uh, obviously don't put it in the dryer right the rep said the same don't put it in the dryer let it air dry uh, and from personal experience i guarantee you the shoes are going to look phenomenal it's going to look great don't you know gr grind it as you're cleaning it but just be gentle and let it soak keep doing it and then again the, this one right here is to help remove those uh, harder stains so I really hope this was helpful, guys, uh, and anyone else that's watching to learn how to clean their shoes, particularly white shoes. And it's really more to answer a question to a subscriber. So that's all for this video, guys. I do appreciate your time, and I really hope this helped you out. So, And if it did, do comment below. Other than that, I look forward to seeing you in our next one. Till then, train intentionally with maximum effort and be one with the iron.